You've just found out you're pregnant and gone along for your scan appointment. The sonographer says there's a baby there and it's about six or eight weeks old. And then you attend for a repeat scan the following month. And the sonographer says, um, madam, actually there are two babies, you're carrying twins. What? What would you believe? In this video, I will explain how a 30 year old woman who was already pregnant, conceived again and ended up giving birth to twins. Hi, welcome to the channel. I'm Dr. Sylvia, a general practitioner and health educator with Ask Away Health. We love talking about women's health and family's health on this channel. I love to help you learn about your body so you can live better. So this story came out recently about a couple with secondary infertility. Secondary infertility is when a couple are unable to conceive a child despite already having had children before. It also comes with its own physical and emotional frustration. It could be that they've had kids before together or separately in previous relationships. Unfortunately, it is as common as primary infertility when a couple who has never had kids before are able to get pregnant. So in the case of this story we're looking at, a couple had their first child in 2018 and hoped to continue their family, but nothing happened. You can read all about their story. I'll place the link in the description box. They had three miscarriages along the road as they were looking for another child. Having one miscarriage alone is traumatic enough, but they had three and she nearly died during one experience. But on the back of all this drama in their pregnancy journey, she became pregnant. She had a five week scan that identified her as pregnant with one baby. But when she went back for a seven week scan, she learned another baby was present in her womb. So what happened? Did the sonographer miss the second baby on the earlier scan? You might think so. However, they were able to date the age of both babies and they were conceived two weeks apart. So there was no mistake. The five week scan showed one baby, but at seven weeks, there were two. Is this possible? Is it one of those miracles of nature? In medicine, we have this rare condition known as superfetation or double pregnancy, where a second pregnancy can happen soon after the first, literally within days or weeks. So it is possible we have records of this happening before now, but here are five facts about double pregnancy. Number one, superfetation is a type of twin pregnancy. The second baby is conceived after the mother is already pregnant with the first. And what you will have is two babies of different ages in the mom simultaneously at the same time. When it comes to twin pregnancy broadly, you can have maternal or identical twins where one egg is fertilized and then splits into two, giving two identical babies. In fraternal or non-identical twins, more than one egg is fertilized, giving rise to two non-identical babies. In the case of these non-identical twins, these two eggs have been released in the same menstrual cycle as can sometimes happen. The second fact I'd like to share about double pregnancy is the mystery of double pregnancy, which is that ovulation, fertilization and implantation happen when a woman is already pregnant. Theoretically, that shouldn't happen. Now, as soon as a woman gets pregnant in one menstrual cycle, many things start to happen to protect that pregnancy. First, to prevent you from releasing any more eggs, your body starts to produce very high levels of the hormone progesterone. What this does is that it prevents your ovaries follicles temporarily from growing so they can't release any more eggs until we're done with the baby that you're already pregnant with. Next, your cervix seals off your womb with a mucus plug as soon as implantation of that pregnancy happens. This should prevent any sperm from traveling upwards to fertilize another egg just in case the first plan failed. Now please go and check out my video all about the functions of your cervix. It's an amazing part of your womb. Thirdly, your womb's lining adjusts to maintain your pregnancy. It's changing to support your placenta and the amniotic sac that holds the baby. It is not preparing to have another freshly fertilized egg to come and implant because this could harm the first pregnancy. But all these events are overturned in a double pregnancy. These protections vanish, but the likelihood of these events is extremely rare in human beings, except in the context of IVF, in vitro fertilization. 
and the thinking is that this event going ahead to happen despite all these protections that the body has in place are a side effect of the high doses of fertility drugs that IVF patients must have to stimulate their ovaries. Another instance is if some types of hormone replacement therapy are being used to treat other medical conditions. I hope you're finding this video informative. Please like it if you do, subscribe to the channel and let me know in the comments section. The third fact I want to tell you about double pregnancy is that the twins are of different gestational ages. So far, we've only heard reports of twins about two to four weeks apart in age. However, doctors would like to deliver them together as much as possible despite being of different gestational ages. So if you have a double pregnancy, you will likely have an induction of labor and a planned caesarean section. It might be that the younger baby is born prematurely, but at an age where the risk to it is minimal. The fourth fact is that a woman can carry a double pregnancy where the babies have two different fathers. It has happened. In that case, mom would have been with one dad a week or two before the second dad, and the babies will be fraternal twins with different gestational ages. And fifth, there are no symptoms of superfetation. It is detected when your sonographer notices that one baby appears bigger or older on your scan. They may also pick up additional features like the heartbeats or other parts that do not appear to be growing at the same rate. And although it is rare in humans, this remarkable phenomenon of double pregnancy is quite common in animals like dogs and cats and rabbits. If you'd like more amazing videos about your health and your family, check out this one here where I discuss why you find it hard to discuss with your kids about intimacy and things around the S word. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure you like this video, subscribe, and I'll see you in the comments. First, to prevent you from, first, to prevent you from providing, oh Lord have mercy.